Here are the numbers 1, 2, 3, and so on till 10. Can you place plus and minus signs between them to make the total zero? With 1, 2, and 3, place a plus sign here and a negative sign before 3, the total is zero. With 1 to 4, 1 plus 4 gives 5, so do 2 and 3. Placing the signs like this gives zero. Can we do the same with 1 to 5? Placing the signs like this gives 1. Changing them gives 3. Turns out it's impossible, no matter how you arrange the signs. What if we go up to 7? Place the signs like this, and we get a 0. So for some numbers, we can get a total of 0, but for others, we can't. Why? For the total to be 0, the sum of numbers with a plus sign must be equal to the sum of numbers with the negative sign. If both sums are s, the total is 2s, an even number. Like for 1 to 7, the total is 28. We can split it into two equal parts of 14. One part, 1, 2, 4, and 7. The other, 3, 5, and 6. Add plus signs to the first part, minus to the second, and we have a 0. For 1 to 5, the sum is 15, an odd number, so it can't be split equally. That's why it's impossible. Now your turn.